Hello everyone and welcome back. Today I have this look I want to create for you. And it's using the some um, LA Colors Eyeshadow Trio in Seductive. Got inspired by Angela Early who purchased some of these and mentioned how I had picked some up. Before anything I'm going to apply some of this NYC Lip Sliders. And this is in Sugar Kiss. I've been working on this. Seriously, my lips are extremely dry. So, mm. gives off a very pale pink tint. Very little bit. And since my lips are pigmented, it helps. Okay, let me first begin with what I used to get this look on this out. I applied my um where is it? this facial primer, it's by L'Oreal. First time using it. It's a face primer. I didn't bring my moisturizer, but anyways, um, after that, I applied the LA Girls Pro Conceal, and I believe this is in Fawn. If it's not the shade, I'll put in the description box down below. Also, the concealing with the Elf Concealer. This is in Light. Lip broke off of mine, but that's what it looks like. And I did a tiny bit of highlighting around my brows. This up concealer. This is like a corrective one, yellow. Did my brows with the Wet n Wild browser. And this is in Ash Brown. I primed my eyelids with the Ruby Kisses that I departed. Eyelid primer. Still working on that. And I think that's it. Now let's get on the look. Okay. First things first. I took this um, Aziza palette, and this is in Paris. I cut out the name of the packaging and placed it on there. Or else I'd have forgotten, because I have a few of these. I'm picking up that shadow right there on the end. It's a matte cream shadow. Apply that on my brow bone. Oh yeah, <laughs> I took this LA Colors eyeshadow palette, and this is an Aquatic Paradise. Picking up that orange right there where my finger is. With a blending brush. Apply that right there in the crease. To warm the look. Maybe wondering, it's a neutral, natural look. Why would you apply orange? So I can get that effect right there. Just warms it up. Really nice. Blend that. Like that. Like so. 
focusing mostly on the outer part right there. Okay, with the same blending brush, I'm going to be picking up this NYX blush, and this is in taupe. Pick some of that up and apply it in the crease as well. Picking up the LA Colors eyeshadow palette in Seductive. And I'll be picking up that gorgeous taupe right there. With an LA Colors eyeshadow brush. Apply that on my lid. This taupe is so, so pretty. And if you notice, I pat my shadows, especially onto the lid. So a lot of people ask me, um, how do you not get fallout? I tap my brush out. Even when I'm applying blush or highlighter. I love that too. It's gorgeous. You know what I didn't do? I don't do now. That same brush I just applied um my shadow, that taupe eyeshadow. I'm gonna go in with that middle one right there. Apply it into my um tear duct. See how that works out. Quite nice. Okay. Oh, I like that. Mm hmm. Worked up very well. Okay. Um, what is next? Oh, taking the Wet n Wild browser. This Nika K brow brush. Which is very firm. I'm gonna take that that bottom powder right there, darkest. Pick that up. I'm gonna line my eye. I'm gonna lash line with that. I was gonna use a liquid liner and then changed my mind, picked up a pencil, changed my mind. I said, you know what, I'm just going to use a powder. And this powder is just dark enough to get the job done. Let's see, highly pigmented, as you can see. Does the job. Most definitely does the job. Mm -hmm. And I'm going right there, outer, what they call the outer ray. Really sorry about that. Um, I ran out of memory, so I have to work quickly. If not, I'm going to have to finish on the tablet. Okay, so I'm just going to darken this area right here. I'll be my outer V to the crease, but just right here. Just a little. I'm blending up as I go. Some of that soap. 
my NYX blush. Blend out some more. Mm -hmm. I'm going to pick up the brush that I used to apply that Aziza highlight with. The shade right there. Matter of fact, I'm not going to pick up any more product. It's just to blend it off some here. And the highlight. I'll go back. Blend some more. And that looks about right. Now I took this um, shade from the LA Colors Seductive. I'll pick it up one more time. It's a pretty champagne toned eyeshadow. I'm going to pop it right in the center. Right there. Just right there. Even a little more dimension. Oh, like that. Oh, yes. Work it. Um, I'm gonna apply LA Colors blush, and this is in Spice, highly pigmented. Yes, a dollar, but um, you'd be surprised. Just, just a little bit. Trust me, and I'm still tapping. A little goes a long way. I'm gonna run by a tip that I had um, showed you guys, I think it was last year, two years ago. If you go overboard with your blush or your contour, take your face brush. This one's by Kiss Beauty Supply Store. This is a medium. The same brush you used to apply your face powder Take it from the lid. You go over it like so, and it tones it down. Yeah, mascara. I'm curl my lashes. You know what? I think I'm gonna take the purple. I might as well, right? Why not? Got this little detail brush. Apply that on my lower lash line. Let's see how that works out. That looks pretty. Just right there. Outer half. I'm sorry. Yeah, I like the way that looks. I have to see the eye doctor like really soon. But um, he's kind of booked up, so um, after this we're gonna be going to Dollar Tree because I really need a pair of reading glasses, like real bad. I'm bring the camera in so you can see. How that turned out. And it's the LA Colors eyeshadow trio in Seductive. Some other products, of course. Yeah, um, I was reluctant to pick this palette up a few years ago when I did, but I'm so glad I did. Mm, they're not eyeshadows that I use on the regular, but for tutorials, they're a lot of fun. So, yeah, we're going to be going out to the store. I really need to check out their reading glasses. So, let me give you one last look. That purple on the bottom made a big difference. It really did. So, that's it my little neutral eye look for today I hope you enjoyed and thank you Angela for reminding me that I had these LA Colors eyeshadow trios 
you know? Because sometimes I, I have so much makeup I forget. And I haven't forgotten about the request of the makeup collection. So that's seductive. I own all of the LA colors eyeshadow trios. Yeah. Wait till you see my makeup collection soon. So that is it. Thank you, Angela Early. And thank you all so very much for watching. May God continue to bless you and each and every one of you always. Until next time, may you all stay blessed, beautiful, and ciao.